Hey y'all, Chris Bassett here, and I'm going to show you how to pair your Roku remote or your phone to your Roku TV. Let's get into it. One thing to try if you're having trouble is to unplug your TV from power for 30 seconds and then plug it back in. You'll also want to make sure that the remote has fresh batteries and that the batteries are inserted correctly. The power buttons are directly on the TV underneath the front label. That way you can turn the TV on without having access to the remote. There are two different styles of remotes. There's the infrared remote and the advanced remote with voice control. The infrared is the simplest to control. Uh, you just basically insert fresh batteries, point the remote at the television, and move the buttons for approximately 30 seconds to a minute until it syncs up automatically. Just make sure there's no objects blocking the television or that you have a second Roku device on at the same time. Point the remote at the TV, press the up and the down buttons until you see the menu move and then you're good to go. The other style of Roku remote has a pairing button and a green status light. So for this style, you'll have to remove the battery cover, hold the pairing button until the status light flashes, and then the remote begins a pairing process. It should take 5 to 10 seconds to pair, and once you've done that, you've successfully paired the remote to the TV. Remember, if you're still having trouble, unplug the TV, plug the TV back in, replace the batteries, and also check your Wi-Fi. If you want to access the TV but you don't have a remote, you can also download the app to your phone, and you can use your phone as a remote. Go ahead and go to the App Store or Google Play Store and search for your Roku mobile app. It should be near the top of the list, but you're going to want to look for Roku Official Remote Control. Uh, download the app. You want to open up the app, go into it, uh, it may ask you to create an account if you haven't already done so. It's free, so go ahead and do that part. The app should prompt you to find devices. Um, just go ahead and follow along with the prompts. Connect to the device. You'll need to be on the same Wi-Fi network, both your phone and your television, for this option to come up. But it'll give you a list, and then you choose the TV that you want to control with your phone. If everything was done correctly, you, then you'll be able to use your phone as a Roku remote. Pretty slick. Hey, check out this other video right here. Uh, links in the description, so check that out. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments. If this was helpful, hit the like button. Thanks.